before we get there, though, the cold temperatures in our forecast have emergency medicine providers asking people to pay close attention to the early warning signs for cold weather related injuries. Medical reporter Liz Bonas shares who is at risk and what kind of symptoms to look for. Hey there, everybody. Hello to you. We may be headed for a warm up, but emergency medicine providers that we talk to at Tri Health say the past couple of days have brought in many cold weather injuries. They remind us to be careful with what's under this current layer of snow. The slips, the falls, the broken bones are a chief complaint right now. Here at this Bethesda North Hospital Emergency Department, they also want us to know the early warning signs that the cold is getting to be too much for your body. That numbness and tingling for sure, um, any type of uh, blue or gray discoloration uh, when it comes to things like frostbite and cold contact related injuries, um, any types of uh, chest discomfort, shortness of breath, a feeling like I can't get this work done right now is something to very quickly pay attention to and not push it. Now, obviously, the very young and older adults tend to be most at risk, but the time it takes sometimes to feel some of these symptoms, just a few minutes, according to this team. We want to make sure as we're warming back up, we at least all remember to try and stay safe. I'm medical reporter Liz Bonus. We'll throw it back to you.